I'm often accused of uh, reinventing the wheel when I'm doing things like building another boat. And I, I think it's a little bit of a ridiculous thing to say because I'm not big on catchphrases. But okay, I understand the sentiment and I'd like to address it because I think it's an important thing. So the question is, why am I always reinventing the wheel? Well, first, let's take out the garbagey catchphrase part, I'm not reinventing the wheel. What I'm doing is <clears throat> building something, taking it apart, rebuilding it, testing it, taking it apart again, rebuilding it, building another thing that does the same thing but better, testing that, breaking things down, getting a broken thing, putting things together, figuring out better ways to make things happen, trying things out, trying to, trying to figure out how to make just how to make everything, like ideas, objects, machines, just everything in my life work better. Now the common response to that is, oh no, you're not supposed to do that. There are factories and big companies and they do that for us, so you just need to go to the store and buy the stuff. Well, if you look at the world today, you can see all that stuff these companies and factories are building because it's like floating around in the ocean and filling up garbage dumps. A, it, we have a disposable culture because of this. See, in this uh, mass-produced culture we have gives us convenience at the cost of innovation and improvement and, and real quality of life. And the, the worst part is, is it's always short-term convenience. You end up, it, it ends up being much less convenient when you're just surrounded by mountains of garbage. You don't know what to do. That's a very inconvenient thing. But, you know, when you just have to go to the store and give them money and get your special thing, that's very convenient, even if you're buying trash. <clears throat> so we've got these companies, you know, producing all this garbage and uh, pumping it out into the world and people buying it. Meanwhile, there are like a billion people who could be innovating and creating and inventing, coming up with new ideas to make the world better, your lives better, anything better. And instead of doing that, they're watching TV. 